Hello and welcome back to the channel. My name is Mahesh Karya. You're watching me on YouTube now and in this session, I'm gonna take you through OpenAI. And if you're not familiar about OpenAI, here we go. In this video, we are going to uh, use OpenAI for lots of stuff and it's a kind of revolutionary thing in the future of most of the things that you will see based on the AI technologies only. But uh, AI seems like it's not a future, is is there already and we are gonna I'm gonna introduce uh, you guys with OpenAI. So there are if you go to openai.com uh, if you scroll down here are a bunch of new uh, projects uh, that you can see and the latest one is of course chat gpt everyone is talking about uh, chat gpt uh, that we are going to use right now uh, dolly uh, 2 so this is also kind of image generator you can say you can uh, just imagine any image and just type that what kind of image you want and it's gonna make that image so we are gonna use first uh, chat gpt and here we go and if i scroll down you can see this is useful for lots of stuff you just ask the question about anything you just want to write the code just ask about the code it will answer it so we are going to try this out and now uh, we are going to click here on try so it will uh, you will get this screen if you are using this for the first time it will ask for the login and you need to log in okay and here i'm gonna ask the very simple questions first uh, like the theoretical ones uh describe ai in 10 lines okay let's suppose if you want to write essay it will just type everything for you guys okay and uh, it will again sync with your previous conversation so don't worry if whatever the questions that you will ask after this thing definitely it will keep track of I'm not sure it will keep track or how it works but behind the scene it it learns with the mistakes automatically okay so uh, now if you are a programmer if you want to write a program and if you don't know anything about let's say crypto uh, so basic crypto program in let's suppose js okay so i'm not sure like how it works but let's see here is the basic crypto program here we go so you can like ask anything let's say let's suppose i'm not aware about uh, ruby and if i want to learn ruby you can simply ask for how i can start with ruby lang quickly okay let me see so uh, he, here we go you can ask any code let's suppose any interview question that you want to solve okay install ruby okay it's going it's giving the steps to me i need to install once the ruby is installed then learn the basics from this ruby docs because official docs are really very good and code academy the link is given are you uh, if you want to learn basics these are the sites okay cool this is fair enough any uh, if you know about let's suppose uh, SQL query uh, so I'll say for second highest salary in SQL okay uh, so let's see what we get we should get the SQL query yeah here we go it's using the same query let me see how how it is connected with the previous query okay limit offset one so oh great so let's ask a kind of yes or no questions okay uh yes or no please answer in yes or no uh cassandra is better than mongo db uh, not sure how it will work but oh my god it's not working it is not accurate to say cassandra better than mongodb thank you so much i expecting that uh being ai you should answer uh not properly but diplomatically uh good fair enough 
so this is just a single thing you can join the open uh, like uh, discord group as well <coughs> if you want you can reset the thread you can uh, capabilities is like you can see uh of course how do i make http request of course it will write the code i know uh train the discipline uh, and lots of other stuff i don't want to go deep dive into it but till then uh, you can explore the further things like dolly and just go there let me see if i can open this thing okay and if you if you can log in i'm not sure i can log in with my google account so if you can log in with your google account if you have it already and i should get something okay let's start openai.com uh continue with google i don't have account so i need to create one let me see if i have it already or not because i tried it that that's what i remember but uh, yeah great we got it something went wrong something went wrong means uh i need to sign up once again so let me click on sign up and let me can't i sign up so should i log in oh okay i'll do that so it's taking while but dolly is dolly 2 is another really very really cool project and apart from that uh, there are bunch of other things so don't worry you can transpile your entire php code into the next years into the other languages whatever the code structure that you have you just need to copy paste your code and you are ready to do the things it seems like it's not working for me uh so i want to go there and uh, i'll i'll read more ab more about this api okay let's see openai.com and what what we have we are just exploring the stuff uh we are again going back to the same page not sure why i already have account by the way so it should log in quickly yeah now the text completion uh image generation that we will try so here if i can open something dolly preview app can i click here okay it's not working for me so i'm going to uh, close this up so this one is also good you can uh, uh, do something with this image generation fine tuning <coughs> fine tuning i'm not aware about this fine tuning by the way so what else we can do here can i can i go to examples wow so we have many things that we can do here let's let's see what we have open in a playground text to command okay great so it, it, it's going to write code for me hopefully convert the text into the programmatic command explain as a consequence okay okay so let me submit this thing and i'm not sure what's what is it is doing but if i submit it should looking for G gpt no no i'm not looking for it so yeah output send message can i uh but where where is my code i i wanted to see my code okay reach out to convert the text into programmatic command okay okay this this is something command oh, let me see if i can write code fibo series in c++ let me try this oh great it's it's working already so let me grab this and let me it's not writing okay there are uh, things that we can manage from here okay maximum length temperature i guess it is a paid thing so we need to okay these these are the sdks that we can import to our code and we can go deep dive into it if if you want to play around with it you can use this code of course it is paid but you will get your api key from here and like the way <coughs> you can proceed so i got my api key already uh, okay i need to create a secret key uh, this is my personal use and this is how i can integrate to my python code my javascript code and my 
are you getting it guys like this is how you can create your own uh co-pilot like the way so this is really very cool and but we are not going to use this okay we don't want this thing so grammar correction that uh, grammarly uh, same like grammarly but smaller in size if you want to uh, integrate this thing it will take your internet connection but <coughs> it will be faster but of course these are the paid plans so you need to pay uh, it's not simple language to stripe api create a code i'm not sure how it works but sql translate wow great that's what i was looking for means i i i'll tell uh i'll i'll write in a text that the that's the query and it's gonna create the complete query for me so this is another so open gpt is nothing but the combination of these things that's what uh, i can assume for now because this thing if i put in okay great i got it already okay you can see like query is generating itself let me go back to example again factual answering so tweet classifier javascript to python great just you you have your javascript code any project convert it into the python and let's submit the code oh great great absolutely fine in python javascript to python python javascript to python i'm not sure why that many times it wrote the code the same code but <laughs> uh, it's it's in beta it's in beta so don't worry don't worry about this thing so this is this is all about uh, this thing uh, and this is not going to replace humans don't worry it's uh, uh because the reason uh we should use this thing we should learn how to use it how to train your mind okay if you have a small kids just open this thing and tell them that search anything and they will just search and they will learn everything so use case is really very important how you use it this is not something that you can afraid of this is something that you can learn from so that's what i can understand and of course if it will create a program in the future don't worry there are another use cases uh, that uh, it's it's not uh, whatever the ai that we are planning to have in next 5 to 10 years it's not going to uh, uh, understand everything by the way this is a starting thing in the future after 100 years no worries uh, nobody knows after 50 years nobody knows but for now this is in beta and this is a good start so this is it for this tutorial and thank you so much all of you guys for being with me supporting me all the time it's been a pleasure to be here please let me know inside comment box what you want from my side definitely i'll make it for you and don't forget to subscribe my channel if you haven't already and smash that like button if you enjoyed and you can use this thanks button as well in order to contribute like even one dollar is enough to grow our channel so thank you so much see you soon in the next video Ta -da, bye bye